of when it's slippery. Tell me if this better come. Come on the talk to me. I'm catch it up on a piece of box. Is this better, guys? Can you hear me loud and clear? Anyway, so um, I was saying earlier, um, thank you for the birthday wishes. My birthday is in like a uh, couple hours. My birthday is actually the 6th of August. Everybody know that already. Today is the 5th, so we still have a few more hours to go. I know my hair is a mess, but um, I just wanted to jump in to talking about today. As you know that it was my back to school um, giveaways today, the Grace Hamilton Women Empowerment Foundation. And I kind of was expressing to you guys that, you know, I was feeling kind of sad and I still am feeling a little bit down because I feel like last year, um, when not last year, I forgot that COVID had us down for two years. 2019, when I did the back to school giveaways, I wanted to come back, you know, more organized and to make it bigger and better. I did everything in my power to make this event a more organized and a better one. In 2019, when I had like over 500 book bags, I tell myself that this time when I do it again, I want to have more to give and I want to make it more organized and I want to do it better. Of course, I had more to give this time and I did, you know, get more organized. We printed armbands and we gave it out to people before they enter the venue and what the plan was for us to issue the armbands give them the vouchers and then we'll cut the armbands when they're exiting however multitude of people came out again greater than we expected and even when you know getting involved with the jamaica constabulary force just to ensure like people's safety and the event running smooth you know smoother than it did before it was still a task. It was a lot of chaos. But there's a lot of people that is mad um, or are maybe upset. But personally, within myself, I'm not upset. I'm more... I understand. That's really what I want to say. I don't want nobody to feel like, oh, Spice is mad at you or whatever. I understand because at the end of the day... I know that people was pushing because they wanted, obviously, to get to the front. I know that people were pushing because, obviously, they wanted that envelope. So I definitely understand. Now it's for me to kind of come back with my group and say, okay, we printed the armbands. We got the security barriers. We got the Jamaica Constabulary Force involved. What more or what else can we do? I mean, in my head, coming when I was driving, you know, to the hotel, I'm thinking, all right. What else me I do? Because it's either me go stop or me go give up. But me is not a person for give up. Me not easy for give up. I just saw me stay. When the challenges come, I always try to find a way to fix it. So now I'm here and I want us to come together. People can, you know, share their thoughts and their views. Because I can't do it alone. I'm just one person, you know. Um, and... In my head, I'm thinking, should I find a way how to make there be an exit, an entrance and an exit, and then people just leave rather than having a big gathering because I know that I have a huge following. So obviously, if I announce something, there's going to be a large turnout. Turnout. So I think we kind of passed that stage where we can't expect small amounts of people. But I'm not. I'm again. I'm just not mad. I just want us to chime in and say, oh, we can do this together. So. Um, like I said, you know, me alone can't do it. All of us have to come together and do it. I'm just one person. And, and I, me alone never do it. Um, there's people that was there giving their help and their support. There's so many people for me to give thanks to. Even on my, where's my other phone? Even on my Instagram page, I have my other phone here. Um, that I want to give thanks to a few people that made the, their donation you know from my instagram page and it don't matter how small it was so it started from chin wendy thank you for your donation kelly sal salvari thank you vanessa white thank you tamara haynes thank you robert kenner thank you for your donation towards the grace hamilton women empowerment foundation can i receive your donation thank you and these are like people that did my cash app they did my paypal 
some people send fifty dollars some people send forty dollars some people send thirty you have people that send twenty at the end of the day i'm not making mention of the small amount it's the thought that counts and i want you to know that you are appreciated the vouchers was purchased your input was appreciated and you know i'm just super happy that everybody chime in and did their part now we want to see how we can make it better because we still have to continue to make it better shandice burke thank you for your donation rashina bowen thank you for your donation anita simone mr brown richian jackson that's rich rush She's also my travel agent, you know. In time, I'm going to look where I'm going to a nice place. Them find rich rush, rich rush, yeah. And she can find you anywhere in the world. Sat you out nice and proper. She made a huge donation. Richie and Jackson, big up yourself. Fitzroy Co., thank you so much. Melody, thank you for your donation. Um, what is K R Y? Did that not cry? Cry spell with K. Anyway, K R Y, you know your name. The last name is Claire, and you spell it clear with and again with another with a K instead of a C. So cry clear, I guess that's your name. I receive a donation. Thank you so much. Um Lake, thank you for your donation to the Grace Hamilton Women Empowerment Foundation. Shane Henry, I receive your donation. Doc Jacqueline, thank you so much. Nashana Allison, thank you for your donation. Shakara. Arsha Kyrie, thank you so much for your donation. Dalan Jones. Oh, Dalan, that's an epic Jones from UK, the DJ. He made a donation. Thank you so much. Ruth Noons, thank you. Simone Hamilton, big up yourself. Me and you have the same last name, Hamilton. Thank you for your donation. D, that was not a donation. Althea, thank you so much. Sean Willie, thank you. Shanisa Garner, thank you. And angel naya thank you jasmine davis no um who's this jadine smart thank you so much angel maxwell jessica thank you alicia wakefield thank you anita simone thank you so much levia dm thank you so much camille thank you for your donation deidre channer thank you antina james thank you tanisha i receive a donation simone thank you so much for your donation yolanda thank you tania thank you um p monique haynes thank you heinz that is thank you so much uh who else is this and i think that was it these are people who were sending like when i've made my post and i was um say, telling everybody to jump in there's a lot of people that was like donating whether 20 dollar whether 50 dollar um people were sending so you all made a difference and you are appreciated and i thank you jada kingdom good buddy jada kingdom thank you for your donation we received over a hundred thousand dollars from jada kingdom and the reason why I, I i was sad and the reason why i feel disappointed is because even though i went with over five million dollars worth of vouchers i still have vouchers leave back and mothers left without vouchers. That's why I feel some kind of way. Because in my head, I said, you know, you know, so many people came out from early. People was pushing. There was chaos. Yes, it is true. People fainted in the audience. It was a huge audience. The outside was hot, obviously. People waiting for a long time. But I personally say I'm not mad because no rich people never out there. Them Afi had wanted it to be out there standing in the sun and waiting for the vouchers. And I'm sad that they came and that they left and I'm still with the vouchers. And I was trying to take the mic to talk to them, to tell them, say, look here, wanna calm down, I have the vouchers here. So that's why I'm going to show it. The vouchers were separated in like units, 100, 100, 50, 50. This is one set. This is another set. This is another set. This is another set. And I can go on and on and I can open the vouchers, open the envelope and show them as well. I kept, I keep, I keep, I take the microphone and I keep, I talk to them. I may say, guys, calm down. We have enough. 
we have enough so everybody could get you don't need to push but no it's like i understand that's why i'm saying i'm not coming here aggressively to say lord I don't do this i don't do that i don't never that listen it's just for me and my team to come back now and say okay how can we make sure that when them come it's just a single file and them take them go them take it and go because all the vouchers are here and you guys came and left without it because there was a chaos and the jamaica constabulary force advised advise us that we would have to stop because people start pushing and there was kids there there was kids in the audience and people people um people health come first so there's absolutely no way I could be still giving out vouchers when people in the audience is fainting. These are vouchers. Yeah. We all have to come together with a solution. Me alone can't beat. So who ever go and feel like say, who not go send me do this, I'm gonna do that. I did absolutely everything in my power to make sure that the event was a huge success. I tried my best. I rented over 50 security barricades. I hired the, the um, a security team. The Jamaica Constabulary Force came on board. They gave us the permit and the permission, you know, to keep it at the Oak Gardens. See the voucher them, yeah? They're all here. They're still all here. And I was trying to explain to people, say, calm down, let, let us find a, a solution to give up the vouchers. But I had to stop because people helped come first and there was kids there. I had to stop. So I'm not wanting to feel like the envelope them empty. So anybody have a suggestion? No, no, come. Because we have to figure this out. And now all the mothers them leave. And on September morning, the vultures are here. They are all here. I, I mean, keep, I take the mic and I tell you no. But I don't know if you never believe. So I want to see it for themselves. They say, go to some of the churches and let us go there and collect it. That's a good idea. I was planning to go to some of the schools because I'm sure that the teachers there, um, no parents that is in need and no parents that, you know, is coming there with our books. So I was planning to go to some of the schools. But look at all of these vouchers. And let me tell you, this is vouchers that I had on myself personally. My sister still have vouchers. There's other people on, uh, on, on the committee that had vouchers. So, what am I going to do with all of them money when I already spent up and buy a voucher? I keep telling people, calm down. Make we get through this together. I had to leave the venue before it, um, before it ended for, my, for, for people's safety. Because I never feel unsafe. I know people not do me nothing. But there's kids in the crowd. People started fainting. People was really fainting in the audience. And that's why I'm feeling sad because I did this for my birthday because I feel like it would have made me happy. The vouchers are here. Somebody said, try another parish spice. Some, somebody said, come to St. Anne's. The vouchers, them there, put down, put them here. Millions of dollars was spent on these vouchers millions of dollars oh i don't want to forget this package came to me from burger king i um i was thanking burger king when i was on stage but i want to also make this special announcement that this package came to me from burger king and these are the the, the um this is what i want you know for company that we support to come back and support us because at the end of the day are we Go eat at burger them and then something there. So when Burger King sent this envelope, it warmed my heart. So guys continue to support Burger King. I don't even know what's in there. Me and you are pull it together. But I'm just trying to show you that there's companies there that really love and care about us and is willing to give back. But we have to come back on a better behavior. It doesn't make sense that we're pushing and 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 trying to cause a chaos. So thanks again to Burger King. I still have your envelope and I'm super, super excited that you came on board with us. And I'm going to make sure that these are given out. Um, yep. This is amazing. This is super amazing. Big up to Burger King, Popeyes, and Little Caesar. This is amazing. Look at that.
yeah it's like it just made me feel sad for the mothers but um we're gonna find a way to make this bigger and better and more organized as we go but i had to stop issuing out the um the envelopes because there was too much people too many people too many people and i kept telling them i kept taking the mic i kept saying you don't have to push you're going to get the envelope but i guess they never believe me and see i'm left back with all the envelopes and all the vouchers so again big up burger king and big up Popeyes and big up little caesar pizza make sure that's where you eat and support because i them and support we i have a package here um from them and i'm going to make sure that we um the mothers and the children get it so that was from burger king and popeyes what am i gonna do with the envelope let's talk about this now how do i donate from time to time i'm going to post um the bank account that we have for the foundation is it is a registered company as well so we do have a bank account what i'm going to also do i'm going to set up a gofundme i'm going to start from this year collecting from this year for next year so that i can make it bigger because i think there's no secret out there when you realize the amount of thousands of people will come out when it's a back to school and again i can't do it by myself we all have to do it to get together go to the most needed schools check your dm spice can you go and give away in saint anne next garden for parents multiply by the 14 multiply it by the 14 parishes let them use the same armband that was given to pick up that would be amazing because there was people that came out from as early as 7 a.m this morning i don't know if they cut off the armbands as yet but maybe if them cut it off them probably still have it in their position so that's also still a good idea i can distribute it to certain places and have them bring that armband to get it give them the opportunity first um you know that's also a good idea thank you bestie for that one i think that's a good idea find a way to spread it around the 14 parishes can i have one please spice i am a single mother top girl 25 send me a dm that's no problem come to old arbor but i think you should do it in a way instead of letting everyone come in all at once you need to start it earlier give the children who lost their parents Give the children in the homes. Let the teachers email the students to come and pick them up. Yeah, like the tax officer. I've sent it to a tax officer, the passport office. Check your DM, please. I still believe you should give it to them, different schools, and allow the schools to distribute them. Go into each parish. Come to Clarendon, please. Maybe do it in the do it parish by parish. Send them to all parishes. Tell them to the church in each parishes. Being on stage with you was the best. Coming to Maypen, please. Oh, I love Spice. I love you too, guys. Take numbers or something. What about the students who came from? What? That one who, yeah, yeah, you guys are typing fast. <laughs> I a dazzle. Don't give the government official schools are better. Allow the kids to enter based on their age group. I can distribute it in St. Elizabeth for you, Spice. Remember, remember Alka Vida water thank you so much you kept the people you kept everyone hydrated i got to take time out to say big up to um Alka Vida water they kept the people them really refreshed with the water as i tell you that it was so many people that came out and yeah you know i told you what happened in the audience to some people so we have to big up Alka Vida water who came on board and was just distributing water because yes we have to keep the people them refresh oh my god so beautiful thank you yeah man guys send up the suggestions um spice for prime minister use the bands once for the armbands is finished when they receive the envelope cut off the armband that's what we were trying to do today um just like a stage show them get them armband and you're letting 20 persons alone at a time that's a good idea accountability is everything make sure them sign when them come get them voucher i really need one please buy some textbook i send it to school give it out in the schools is a good idea yes yeah, so i mean i'm left back with all of this and if we start check i'm sure this is going to be a whole lot of money right here because these are worth five five thousand dollars 
count with me five thousand at a ten thousand dollar five ten fifteen twenty twenty five thirty thirty five forty forty five fifty fifty five sixty sixty five seventy seventy five eighty eighty five ninety ninety five one hundred this alone a hundred thousand look at how thin this is so i just want you to imagine i probably have one million dollar what type something as a left back this alone is worth a hundred thousand dollars and look how many envelopes i have and this is one of the reasons why I feel sad. Because if you came today and saw the amount of children and parents that was there that should have been at home with this, waking up in the morning to buy supplies and stuff for school, I'm left with it because of the chaos. That's not what I wanted. So yes, I do feel a little bit sad. And I am going to find a way how to fix it. But I just wanted to just come live real quick to just explain to you guys what happened and just to tell everybody thanks. And also to let you know that I'm not mad at anyone. I understand. I love you guys still. I truly appreciate everyone that um, came on board and support Magnum Tonic Wine. You were the first company to call me and give a check for $1.5 million. That for me goes, you know, I'm beyond, I'm lost for words. Like that is just amazing as a company so big up to magnum tonic wine that is why magnum is the only thing i drink right there so um someone said can i get one please um have an entrance and an exit gate with two of your workers once they receive the voucher they go out. Oh, that's my idea that's what i think of that's what i thought about so thank you for that i think that's a very good input um can i get one well guys it's all yours it's still here for you to get. We just got to find a better way how to issue the rest that we have. We did manage to issue out a few today. We gave away um, some. As I told you, we did have a lot of vouchers. But, you know, unfortunately, I'm still left back with some. And that's how it go. I still love you guys. I understand. I appreciate it. When I went there, I told people that, you know, I was once in the position that the mothers are out there today are in so i get it and my mother was in a position that the mothers that came out today is actually in so i understand i want to thank everyone um all the companies that contributed dream weekend we have um donations from dream weekend over two hundred thousand dollars where's my phone again let me go back because i like to give thanks to people who really support so big up to dream weekend um i hope i didn't forget to, to test to say thanks to anyone kingston bookshop all of these vouchers are from Kingston Bookshop. My first transaction with them was, you know, it's $3 million. And when I purchased the, 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 the vouchers for $3 million, they donated on top of the $3 million. So we got extra vouchers that was worth maybe three hundred dollars or $500,000. So thank you so much to Kingston Bookshop for coming on board and getting these vouchers out for me so swiftly, so quickly um, for the mothers. I truly appreciate you. And we're going to find a way how to distribute this the best way that we can. So big up to Kingston Bookshop for these vouchers. Um, yeah great island we spoke about that big up sparky baby of course living room bar and dining that's on 20 eastwood park road thank you so much for your donation we love you and appreciate you and guys i'm going to try to shower and shake off this energy of feeling sad that my mother's was left you know without no voucher and it's gonna be my birthday in a few hours Woo! August 6th is my birthday, guys. It's counting down. We're rounding it up. Somebody said, come to Barbados. Can I get one, please? I really need. We're definitely going give to the, give these out, guys. I love you. I love you guys. I love you guys. And like I said, I'm not going to stop. I'm going to try to make it bigger and better every year as we go by and more organized. Thanks again to the Jamaica Constabulary Force. They were amazing today. They helped me out extremely a lot. Police officers was leaving the venue with people who was, you know, fainting or passing out because of the capacity. So I really, really want to big up the Jamaica Constabulary Force. They did an amazing job today. 
I truly love you guys. Thank you. Together we're stronger. Don't f um, feel free to leave your comments and let me know how better you think we can issue these out as well as for next year, how we can make it more better and more organized. I love you guys. Shout out to everyone on the Grace Hamilton Women Empowerment Foundation. Fenice Hamilton, my sister, I could not have done this without you. I love you dearly. Um, Aisha, Ray Alexander from Cool Booking Agent and your beautiful wife, Dev. Thank you, guys. Um, who else? My love and hip-hop family. Carly, thank you for coming. Mida, thank you for coming. Estelita, thank you for coming. Who else? There's so many other people. Um... So many people on this team. Angel! Oh my God, my friend from Miami. She was in those emails replying to you guys tirelessly for nights, sending out information. Thank you to Angel. Stay strong. Woo! I should have write a list. There's so many people that is behind the scenes helping to make this possible. Big up to Stacy Chong. Big up to Angel. Um... Yeah, I know there's other people out there. Um, the name's not coming. Um, yeah. Jada Kingdom, Mr. C. Just Live. Me tell the pimper, me tell the people them twinkle. Me tell the people them twinkle. Say you make the kids them have book and pencil twinkle. Yes, twinkle. Yeah, girl. <laughs> Jada Kingdom, I just said that she, she joined. I was telling you that, um... I was so appreciative when she came on board and made her huge donation. Um, so big up, you, you don't know. And her song is out today. Make sure you, you support our song. Our song, drop our song out. So make sure you support GPP. Somebody text me. Can I just set up in the room for 10, 11? Okay. All right, guys. So I'm going to get ready for my birthday. It's coming up in a few hours. Leo Gang, Leo season, August 6th is my birthday. And I'm super happy. I'm super excited. As I'm ready, I haven't slept. But yeah, again, we're going to figure out how to get these vouchers out to everyone out there. I love, love, love you guys. Thank you for the support. Big up to everyone from Grace Hamilton Woman Empowerment Foundation. Jada Kingdom say happy birthday, my love. Love you, Twinkle. Yeah, make sure to stream our song out now. I have a few songs out as well, but that's for a whole different live. I just came to tell you guys thank you and that I'm not mad at you. We are definitely going to figure this out together. I love you guys. <laughs>